Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's your boy Tony Basketball back again with another game review. Now you see, I've been playing this game Watch Dogs Legion for the past couple of weeks. And you know, I was really excited for this. But you know, I always bring you my honest thoughts, honest feelings and honest criticism. So if there's anything wrong with it, I'm going to tell you. But before we get into that, I would like to thank today's sponsor, Seeky, for coming back another time after a lengthy hiatus without sponsoring me. I don't take it personally, fellas. I get it. You know, things get tough. But look... As you know, SeatGeek is the best place to buy any tickets for any event. And you know, with my code, you can get at least 1% off your next purchase. And as you know, concerts are big right now. There's so much stuff going on. You're not going to want to miss out on this, guys. And if you want to feel a bit more generous, you know, you can donate to the Patreon. You can get on the channel, get some good, uh, good, good benefits. And you get in our Discord server. And, you know, right now, the... Uh, the general chat's locked because there were some events and I don't really want to discuss it, but uh, yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll open it back up eventually and you can get in there and you can get your rewards. Thank you if you consider doing that. If not, let's get into the video anyway. It's free content, baby. As you know, this is actually a recruitment tool being used by the US military to show you uh, the dangers of being a terrorist and how you should actually be a US military. So, uh, the first gameplay we can be introduced is shooting. Never done before in a video game, as you, uh, as you I'm sure you know. Uh, most video games uh, don't have no shooting because it's violent, and uh, there's no violence allowed in games. So, you know, that's. Um, I mean, the thing is, we can't even hear me right now because my voice is so low quality, and that's kind of the point of the entire video. It's kind of a joke. So, I'm just going to keep saying shit. Anyway, yeah. so there's this bit in the in game where I drive a car and you are in uh, you know, uh, uh, you know, the streets of Rio and uh, you be uh, and uh, yeah, so basically you are drifting and uh, the, the wheel comes off the car and your your insurgent officer commander squeezing you and says, "Hello, most of all, do you have a And uh, basically, yeah, so that's uh, you know one of those things. For the soundtrack, you've got Bang Ram by Skrillex, big fan of that one, and uh, you also got uh, Mr. Brightside by The Killers, you know, they play that one at half speed though, so you can see the copyright. So, you know, it's not quite as special, but you know, it's still pretty good. Anyway, uh, there is this part in the game where um, you are going up uh, a mountain on a pilgrimage, and uh, you have to deliver the ashes of your, of your fallen cousin, and uh, he says, uh, as in the last iron breast, have you ever pre-ordered Red Faction Real before? It's going to be a really good game, but trust me, brother. Trust me, brother. Play Red Faction Real. So the rest of the game is just playing Red Faction Real. In fact, as soon as you start the game, the actual game Red Faction Real is on the computer. I'm actually not sure if that was part of the game or if that was just me, to be honest. But um, yeah. Another great aspect of this game is the sound design. Now, of course, the sound is done by Elon Musk, George R. Martin, and Jazzy Jazzy. So yeah, basically. Oh, 
Thank you all sorts, guys. I really thought this game was something else. I really, really enjoyed the mechanic uh, and the visuals were they were amazing, and there was a lot of gameplay. So, to be honest, I think this game is a solid piece of music. They made it. They spent a lot of time on it, and I really proud of how it came to the team, and uh, it really did make me feel like I was watching dogs. And uh, that's really the most important thing that this game can do. Uh, so if you enjoyed this video, I'd like you to smash that like button. If you agree with me, let me know in the comment section. If you didn't agree, don't bother commenting. Don't want to hear it, buddy. Listen, SeatGeek, thank you for sponsoring me. Subscribe to me on Patreon and get those Discord awards if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys next time when I talk about the atrocities Israel has committed on the rest of the world and its own citizens. See you later.